Hi guys, welcome to another coin phone video. So today I'm be showing you how to do a factory reset on the Moto E5 Play. This is a small variant, but it will work with any uh, Moto E5 Play. So first I'm gonna show you, there's two different ways guys. You can do it from the phone or from the external keys. I'm gonna show you both ways. So first I recommend remove all your accounts just in case, for some people won't know their Gmail, the original Gmail or password, and then this will lock it. So just be warned that if you do a factory reset and you had your Gmail on there, it will request for you to put back your Gmail and original password. So the way to come back that is you want to go into users and accounts. It'll say account right here and you want to remove it. I removed my Gmail account. Remove all your accounts. If you have a Samsung account, per example, you want to remove that as well. So from there, you can just go into, oh, let's see where it's at on this phone. All right, so from there, you want to scroll all the way down. It will assess system. You want to go to reset. So it's a little bit different on this phone, so sorry, it took me a little sec. Factory data reset. You want to click that and then it'll say reset phone and as you can see it will erase everything but um, that's how easy that is now let's say you forgot your passcode and you want to do a factory reset from externally first the phone you have to turn off okay guys so from here all you have to do once the phone has turned off you want to hold down the power button and the volume down at the same time so hold them down hold them down hold them down from here you want to scroll down via the volume down so restart bootloader um, recovery mode so recovery mode click the power button to select and then here it goes says no command so what you want to do is hold the power button and then tap let's see Oh, so you hold down the power button and you tap the volume up. From here, you want to scroll down to where it says wipe data factory reset. If your phone is reset, you will need to enter Google account information, email address, and password associated with this phone to be able to use it again. So at least they warn you now. Um, so there it is. So click power button. But remember, remember, we removed that information so you won't have to. Um, so user data and personalized content so erase everything there you go so now that it's reset it you just want to click reboot system now and you have successfully done a factory reset everything's wiped on the phone it won't have none of your personal information so now you can sell the phone give it to somebody or if you forgot your password you can access it back but remember if you still had your gmail and password in there you will have to put that information back on there so that's how you do a factory reset in the Moto E5 Play. Um, this is a boost mobile variant, but it will work on all the other ones. So thanks for watching, guys. Please comment, rate, subscribe.